I'm Martin Taubert and I'm leading a junior research group in the Microverse cluster. I'm actually a biochemist by training, but when I got first insights into microbial ecology, I was really fascinated how microbes can interact there, how one organism is releasing a waste product that is then taken up by another organism, leading to really complex trophic interactions and food networks uh, in the microbial community that are basically playing on a biochemical level. My research focuses now on elucidation of carbon fluxes in microbial communities where on one end of the spectrum you have primary producers that can build all of their biomolecules themselves while on the other end of the spectrum you have organisms that are even unable to build their most bu basic building blocks um, and depend on other organisms such as the members of the candidate phyla radiation. The Microverse cluster really offers me great opportunities to collaborate with other researchers. For example, I can now track the activity of individual microorganisms on a single cell level in collaboration with other scientists that provide me with methods like Raman microspectroscopy. With these approaches, I'm currently investigating the role of the obligate symbionts of the candidate phyla radiation on carbon fluxes in the groundwater. So groundwater is an important resource for drinking water globally and the groundwater microbiome plays a central role in regenerating the groundwater. But we have only just begun to understand the function of the groundwater microbiome and especially the role of the candidate phyla radiation is still unclear. Also, these organisms can make up up to 60% of the groundwater microbiome. Due to their high abundance and their dependence on other organisms, you can imagine that they play a crucial role for the functioning of the gr groundwater microbiome and the ecosystem services that it provides. And we need to be able to understand this role in order to predict how the groundwater responds to global changes. Mm -hmm.